All right, so we got an absolute classic Nintendo Switch My Way Golden Eye 7. Let's go ahead and see the video. This is a classic game, bro. Nintendo 64 vibes. Get ready to lose. Uh oh. Just like when we were kids. Yeah, right. It's that Mission Impossible, bro. You were done. Someone's got Oh, us. man. Oh, no, no, no. This is giving heavy Nintendo 64 vibes, bro. Find your kids asleep. That's a nice studio. Keeping a rivalry going. That's my really way nice studio Nintendo apartment. Switch. Was that a studio apartment? I don't know. But other than that, bro, I, I, I like the way that Nintendo is doing things, bro. I mean, obviously, I, th I saw this coming a mile away. You know, they're going to bring all the classic games that everybody played, you know, either. I don't, you know what? For some reason, I'm thinking that they're going to they're gonna bring, like, more people on, especially from, like, like an older, like, audience. Because, you know, like, a, a lot of the, um you know, a lot of the. What, what is it? No, Boomers is like 1950, right? It doesn't matter. A lot of the older people play Nintendo 64, uh, Super Nintendo, you know, all the other uh, Nintendo consoles. So, like, you know, for them to bring back a lot of, um, you know, a lot of the older games and make the console. It made the graphics look 10 times better. I said it made the consoles look 10 times better. It made the console. Oh, I said it again. It made the, it made the quality look. <laughs> Bro, I need a script. It made the quality look 10 times better. I fully respect it. Again, if somebody from Nintendo is watching this, we need Diddy Kong Racing. Uh, I think they already got Wave 2. Wave 2 was one of my uh, one of my favorite games, too. But they, I think, is Wave 2? Is, is Wave, uh, uh, is that a Nintendo? Yeah, that's a Nintendo game. Yeah. Yeah. Of course it is. <laughs> of course it is. We need uh, Killer Instinct. Uh, we need uh, Diddy Kong Racing. We need... Uh, uh, um, oh my god, oh my god, there's, there's so, there's so many more, obviously the, we need like the old Pokemon, the old Nintendo 64 Pokemon on here as well, we need a lot of different games on here, bro, a lot. they might as well just remaster all the Nintendo 64 games and put it on the Switch, I don't see why not, you'll make 20, you'll make literally 20 times more than, bro, they need to do it, bro, they need to do it, bro, I mean, if we're doing it from like a business standpoint, it's a good move. If we're doing it for a financial standpoint, bro, you're going to get a lot of more. You gonna, I mean, nah. I would say you're going to get a lot more sales. But again, I feel like you're going to get a lot more sales from the older audience. And I feel like, like uh, you know, a lot of kids nowadays, they don't they don't really, they probably didn't grow up on, you know, the Nintendo 64 like I did. I grew up on the, on the Nintendo 64. I grew up on the GameCube. GameCube was my favorite. It was my first console, by the way, I've ever got. Best console ever. And not just because I got it first. It's literally, well, yeah, it's because I got it first. But other than that, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction. I'm, I'm actually super excited that they got, that they got 007, GoldenEye 007 on the Switch. That's actually pretty cool. Comment down below what you guys think about that. I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out, and peace.